Pat, Postman Pat, Postman Pat, and his black and white cat. Early in the morning, just as day is dawning, he picks up all the post bags in his van. Postman Pat, Postman Pat, Postman Pat, and his black and white cat. All the birds are singing, and the day is just beginning. Pat feels he's a really happy man. Everybody knows his bright red van. All his friends will smile as he waves to greet them. Maybe you can never be sure they'll be knocking rings, letters through your door. <laughs> postman Pat, Postman Pat, Postman Pat, and his black and white cat. Singing, the day is just beginning. Pat feels he's a really happy man. Pat feels he's a really happy man. Pat feels he's a really happy man. Mrs. Goggins. Oh no, wouldn't that be grand? Meow. Are you all right, Mrs. Goggins? Oh, oh, sorry, Pad. I was just looking at this. Hot air balloons? Oh yes, I've always loved a bit of adventure. Uh, <clears throat> still, we can't let that hold up the post. Here you are, Pat. Just two letters today for Ted Glenn. Goodness. Is that all? Aye, it must be because of the snow. It's always a bit lonely around here when it snows. You sure you're all right, Mrs. Goggins? Yes, yes, yes. Off you go now, Pat. Uh, okay. Bye then. Ah, oh, bye, Pat. Balloon. Ah, I know. Come on, Jess. Meow. Right, everyone. Nature Trail Day. Have you all got your lists? Yes, yes, yes Mr. Pringle. Pringle. Come on, then. Let's go and see how many different animals we can find. And birds. And mollusks. That's snails. We'll be able to spot lots of animals with these. Hello. And uh, my dad gave me this bird book. We can use it to find the best birds. <laughs> Let's be the first to find everything on the list. Yeah! Come on, everyone. Let's get going. <laughs> first stop, Greendale Farm. Hello. Ted, careful. Is that you, Pat? Thanks. What are you all excited about? Have you still got that old hot air balloon? Oh, I reckon it's in mill somewhere. What do you want it for? We're going to take Mrs. Goggins ballooning. Come on. Uh, here it is. Been years since I've flown it. Let's get it over to the village green and test it out. Right, Opat. With all this snow, Greendale will look grand from up in the air. We'll need this air bottle to fill up the balloon. Oh. Right then, let's get this balloon blown up.
What's that noise, Ted? Hey, up. Oh. Pat? Oh. Here I am. It sprung a leak. So I see. Don't worry. I'll fix it while you get Mrs. Goggins. Right you are, Ted. Hmm. This yellow one's a crocus. What's that white flower? Oh, that's a snowdrop, that is. Hey? What have you found, Julian? I, I thought I saw something in those bushes. A rabbit? No, I don't think so. Let's go and tell Mr Pringle what we found. Oh! Hello? Hey! I found a dog! Um, dog isn't on the list. Maybe we can write it down anyway. A dog's an animal after all. Well done, Julian. I wonder what she's called. <laughs> hey! Come back! <laughs> oh, oh dear. Oh, where are you taking me, pet? <laughs> it's a surprise. That should stop it flying away. Here, doggy, doggy, doggy. Hello, Ted. Have you seen a little dog anywhere? It's a stray. I've got instructions to take it to Pencaster Lost Dog Zone. Here. Have you got a license for that? Very serious offence, unofficial balloon parking. But it's a surprise for Mrs. Goggins. Well, in that case, I'll let it go this time. But you have to help me find this stray dog. All right, Arthur. But let's be quick about it. Here, doggy. Nice, doggy. doggy. <whistles> Come on, doggy. Come on, where are you? Let's be having you. ta -da! Oh, Pat, a balloon. Oh. It's lovely. Are you going to fly it? Oh, not me, Mrs. Goggins. Ted's the expert at ballooning. I wonder where he's gone. Come on, Pat. Let's have a wee look. Oh, this is exciting. Uh, Pat, what's this here? Let me have a look. Watch out, <coughs> Jess. <coughs> Yes. Oh, no. Isn't that the rope tying us to the ground? Ooh. I wish we could find some birds. You're right, Mira. We haven't found any birds yet. Oh, Mr. Prinkle, Mr. Prinkle, we could try up at tops of ground. Good idea, Sarah. Come on, everyone. Here, doggy, doggy. Arthur, come quick. Have you found the dog? Me, I've lost me balloon. There's always lots of birds over there. But it's too far away to see properly. Hey, we can use my binoculars. Wow. I think I found one. It's big and round and, and stripy with blue and yellow and orange bits. It sounds like a parrot. But you don't get parrots in the snow. Look! Oh, isn't it pretty? It's a... It's a... Hot, hot air, air balloon. balloon! That's a fine sight. There 
you are. It's following those animal tracks. Look, a bird. It's a robin. Well done. That's the last thing on the list, too. Come on, everyone. Time to go back to school. Come on, girl. Whoa. How are we going to get back down? Well, ah, that's it. Mind the church, Mrs. Goggins. Whoa. Watch out. Wow. That's got it. I'm getting the hang of this now. <sighs> well done, Mrs. Goggins. Where are you two going in such a hurry? Hot air balloon. <laughs> Stolen. We've seen it. Up in the sky. <coughs> Me missing dog. Here, doggy. The dog's seen the balloon! Look out! That was close, Mrs. Goggins. Oh, don't worry, Pat. We're perfectly safe. Cloud! Where's it gone? The little dog's got the scent. Come on, everyone. Oh, my word. Piloting my own balloon. Oh, this is an adventure. Uh, there's a field over there. Can we land? Please. Pat. Mrs. Goggins. Over here! Over here! Over here! Here we are! Let some air out. Bring her down and we'll grab the rope. Right you are. Look out below. Here it comes. Somebody grab the rope. That's a brave little dog, that is. Are you two all right? Uh, uh, I think so. Oh, don't worry about me. Well done, Mrs. Goggins. I couldn't have flown it better myself. Oh, well, thank you, Ted. It was a good thing you were there to pull us in. The dog led us to you. <coughs> oh, what a bonny wee doggy. <coughs> Who does she belong to? It's a stray. I've got to take it to the dog's home. Oh, what a shame. I love dogs. And it does seem to like Mrs Goggins as well, Arthur. And it is awfully lonely in the post office. Well, I'll have to ask the dog's home first. I see. Yes, I'll let them know. Well, can I keep her? If you can give her a good home... Of course I will. Then she can stay in Greendale. Yeah! What are you going to call her, Mrs Goggins? Let me see. Um, why don't we call her Bonnie? Because we've had such a Bonnie day. That's grand, Mrs Goggins. Yeah!